Is this depression thing people have been asking? Yeah, of course, me myself, about three weeks ago, I was depressed. I had broken heart. Yeah, oh, like <laughs> sorry. Who broke a nice guy's heart like that? Very good in the building. In the building. <laughs> the energy, oh. energy. You <laughs> You'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs>
this thing is fucked up. You didn't answer about my name. What my name? What's your name? Nita. What's your name? Adhelia. Adhelia. Would you like to tell our fans what? What do you want to say? Do you want a boy? Yes, I want a boyfriend. My name is Adhelia. Go and follow me on IG. In Nexus Adhelia. Hey, hey, hey! Please, we don't do that here. <laughs> Boys, look sharp. IG. Go follow them. If they DM, will you reply? I reply them. Why hey. not? And they are desperate. Mm. <laughs> oh yeah, boy, you she looks out. Thank you very much. Welcome. <laughs> okay, so we have one tall gentleman here. This is the first time I'm interviewing someone who is taller than me. <laughs> Charlie, why are you tall like that? Oh, Charlie, be good. Be good. Say be good. If so, okay, so Martin Kuma, yeah. actress, beautiful actress. What do you admire about her? Um, she's just so amazing. Let me start by saying that way, and then. Honestly, what I admire about her, looking at her personality, her speech, like the fact that she loves God, like she attributes everything to God and all her success, everything she has achieved and then everything she has been able to do and she's doing right now, she attributes it to God and then this actually motivates, motivates me to actually um, work hard and then also make God first in everything I do. So like it's just so amazing. like. If it was any other person, they would have been actually been talking about they themselves, what they have been able to do, what they have been able to achieve by themselves. But she hasn't. She has just been God, 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 God. Okay, okay. Yeah. So aside her being God fearing, what else do? You, what else they bust your brain about the woman? Oh, child, I've been know that one there. Like <laughs> she just know, they tell be me. like she just they be you bab like mm. she's she's probably every man's desire every man's wish you have job 4 verse 1 also come the door yes, we win. Yes, we win. hello what's your name I'm amanda 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 or amanda <sighs> amanda okay <laughs> <laughs> so um the question is simple what do you admire about mata Kuma? okay i admire her for so many reasons but one of the reasons why i admire her because she's generous and I learned she has a foundation, that's the Masa and Koma Foundation. Um, it's a good initiative to give back to society and the needy. And I think that's something we should do. I like her for that. Yeah. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Welcome to Campus of Shark Boy. Oh, thank you. How are you doing? I'm fine and you. Fine, thank you. Okay, so today I'm here to ask you guys about Mata and Kuma. What sure. do you admire about that woman? Oh, okay. Um, before I came to Ghana, I'm Nigerian by the way, so we used to watch her and we laugh at her intonation because her was different from the other actresses. Mm -hmm. So um, I loved her personality since then. Um, the darkness as well, you know, she's, you post dark color is different from our own color. So she was really nice. And then meeting her today has confirmed uh, my attraction and my admiration of her. Hey, Karachi! Welcome to Campus Asia. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Um, today, what I'm asking is, what? Do you admire about Mata Nkuma? The main thing that I like about her is her appearance. You wouldn't see Mata with um, showing skin, like she would say. Let me say that, yes. She's always covered everything. And she's really looking nice. She always looks nice. Yes, so I like her appearance and everything about her. And she being a God-fearing person, yeah. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Hi, her movie say, <laughs> when I watch it, seriously, especially the bad side, when she's doing something bad in movies, I feel like, Getting inside the movie, catching her, giving her some big punch, be like. You're right, what does she do? I don't know, she's just annoying. Like, yeah, she's annoying in the movies. When I watch her movies, she's really annoying. Yeah. But all the same, she's pretty, like, good. Someone, someone wishes to be like her yeah, in the future. Yeah. So, Mata, and see your movies, you are very annoying. <laughs> Mata, Okuma, please. Don't be annoying in the movie take it, okay? Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Thank you very much. Thank you too. Have a lovely day. Okay. What was your name? Uh, hi, I'm Yaira. I'm Lady Pell. Lady Pell. Hey. <laughs> okay, so your question is simple. What do you admire about Mata Nkuma? Mata Nkuma is her personality. She is a very um, real person, even in her movies. And also, I like the way she dresses. She dresses very African and I'm I'm an African lover so I admire her for that so much. I always watch her because of that. I follow her too. Mata, I really love you. Mata, this is Yaira. Yaira. <laughs> the one who needs a boyfriend. Yeah, no, it's the other one. No, one okay, so what about you? Okay, as for me, I think she's a very beautiful woman inside and out. 
she's really beautiful and then she's like a very good role model to everybody so you guys should you know follow her and listen to what she has to say she's a very nice person so matter <laughs> okay thank you very much okay so we have Mata Nkuma here let's talk to Mata Nkuma Mata, welcome. Hi, I'm good. Thank you. Thank You're beautiful. You. <laughs> thank you. Thank oh, I'm very happy to see you. Today. Oh, it's a pleasure. Your name is Shark Boy. Yeah, Shark yeah, Boy. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so Martha, let me ask you, um, what university or SHS did you attend? So I went to Laboni Secondary School. I'm an LA born. Hey. Yes. <laughs> and I went to JE University. Yes. I majored in public relations. Yeah. So I have a first degree in public relations. Okay. So aside JE, what university do you admire the most? Yeah, a lot of like NUS, UCC. I don't know, JE. That's my school. Yeah. <laughs> She's staying faithful. She's staying faithful. <laughs> Okay, so Mata, a lot of people look up to you when it comes to dressing, fashion, and the way you look decent in it. What do you have to see? What's your take on um, dressing, exposing some parts of your body? I think it is not necessary. Um, when you look decent, you are confident of yourself. And you don't need to expose yourself to attract anything to yourself. What belongs to you will definitely come to you. But sometimes it is of a proper value to you. For you to present or represent your own brand in a good way and so for me decency is a trademark for me i don't think i'll go out looking indecent there's no point and i say this to all the youth or everyone looking at me right now or watching me now anytime you have the opportunity to dress well think of decency and be proud of yourself because don't forget that you don't live for you People are also watching and learning from you too as well. Thank you. Okay. So there are a lot of people going through challenges in life. And I know in your career you've been through some challenges. So what do you have to tell them? Like someone going through a challenge, someone depressed, what do you have to tell the person? This, this depression thing, people have been asking yeah, me. Yeah, because me, myself, about three weeks ago, I was depressed. I had broken heart. Yeah, oh, like <laughs> sorry. Who broke a nice guy's heart like <laughs> Yes, yes, you, you, you be <laughs> so you know what um, there's nothing like having faith in God it's unfortunate that most of I mean these days most of the youth don't spend time in the house of God because of social media and even because of the COVID instead of people going to church now that the churches are open people are staying at home and watching TV and when you ask them they will say we are doing church in our house that is wrong Listen, the Bible says, I was glad when they, say, when they said unto me, let us go into the house of the Lord. That's right. In the house of the Lord, there's salvation, there's peace, there's forgiveness, there's joy, there's love, there's mercy, there's comfort. And so if you have God in your life, this broken heart, God will mend it. He Amen. will take care of it Amen. and he will give you someone better. God always gives the best to his children. He doesn't just give us anything. And so listen, it doesn't matter what you're going through. Whether you're looking for a job, whether you're hoping to go to school next year, whether you're looking for something, have faith in God. Believe in God. Spend time with the word of God. Even if you're on social media, follow people on social media who will add value to your life. Not just anybody, but people you can learn good things from. And trust me, don't give up because God hasn't given up on you. With God, all things are possible. Just be patient and work towards your dream. It is possible when God is in it. So have faith in Him. And God never disappoints. He never fails. And so He won't let you down. Thank you. Okay, so my last two questions. Short, short, short. I've been stalking you and I know you have a salon. Yeah, so they are campus students, the girls out there who want to do their hair. So where can they find oh, this? Oh, so we've moved to um, Spinters. It's called Grace Beauty Salon. It's at Shell Signboard. It's called Grace Beauty Salon. And so um, it's, it's a beautiful place and you would like to just come and do your hair. Yeah. You go to Kao. Kao. Okay, so your final way to anybody watching you out there. So if you're watching me, like I said, um, 
just have faith in God and just be patient in life and walk towards your dream. Keep working towards your dream. And don't, don't follow the social media pressure. Live your life. Be true to yourself. And just know that with God, all things are possible. Just have faith. Be determined. Stay focused and believe in God. And he'll favor you at the right time. He'll open the doors you've been praying for at the right time. He's a good God. And he knows when to be good to you. So just be patient and have faith in him. Thank you. That's right. Martha, thank you for having me. You're welcome. Hi, lovely people. If you're watching me, just follow Campus with Shark Boy. He's doing a great job. And let's support him. Thank you. That's the end of today's episode of Campus with Shark Boy. I hope you learned something from this video. Mata came, she said everything, the students still talked about her. So make sure you subscribe. No, make sure you follow Mata first. Mata Ankuma on Instagram, at Mata Ankuma. And make sure you watch her movies. She has a foundation too, you can support through mobile money. And also, she has a saloon. So the girls, all the campus girls you want to do your hair, please. Mata's please, that's the name of the saloon, at Spintex. Yeah, so make sure you subscribe to my channel. Please like the video. Please like the video. Subscribe if you haven't. Like the video and leave a comment. I'm going to see you midweek for more tips. You understand? Thank you very much. Bye bye.